The pathway of blood flows through the heart. Oxygen-poor blood from your body returns to the right atrium of the heart. Blood from your upper body returns through the superior vena cava. Blood from the lower body returns through the inferior vena cava. As the right atrium is filled with blood, it contracts, the tricuspid valve opens, and blood is pumped into the right ventricle of your heart. When the right ventricle is full, the tricuspid valve closes to prevent blood from flowing back into the atrium. The right ventricle contracts, pulmonary valve opens, and blood is pumped into the pulmonary artery and to your lungs. The pulmonary valve closes to prevent blood from flowing back into the ventricle. Oxygen-rich blood from the lungs returns to the left atrium of the heart. As the left atrium is filled with blood, it contracts, the mitral valve opens and blood is pumped into the left ventricle of your heart. This occurs at the same time as the right atrium pumps blood into the right ventricle on the other side of the heart. As the left ventricle is full, the mitral valve closes, the aortic valve opens, the left ventricle contracts, and oxygen-rich blood is pumped into the aorta to reach all parts of your body. This happens at the same time as the right ventricle pumps blood into the pulmonary artery on the other side of the heart. The aortic valve quickly closes to prevent blood from flowing back to the heart. Meanwhile, the atria have filled with blood and the cycle repeats itself.